<laughs> hey everybody, we're here with a different game that I've never put on the channel, or at least I don't think I've ever put it on the channel. This here is Immortal Unchained. And you're probably wondering, what is this game? Uh, f well, it came out, I think, a couple years ago. I, I actually had a physical release. Uh, very few games this generation have had a phys physical release. Especially a game like this, which is really an indie game, or maybe a new competitor. But yes, um can't tell by the HUD, it's a Dark Souls style game, it's a Soulsborne game, but you have guns. And melee is only an afterthought. See this? This is an afterthought. Like that's it, it's, it's one, two. Guns are, you know, yeah. I forget the controls. I have not played this in a while. Okay, yeah. Shotgun. That's a rocket launcher that's really bad. This rocket la launcher I have is really bad. Oh, I have new weapons. They're probably crap. I haven't played this game in a really long time because I, um, I had a problem with it where it, it was, there was a game breaking glitch. Um, wherever I tried to go this one direction on Xbox, I'm playing on Xbox One if you don't know. Uh, it would just crash, and yeah, so I just kind of gave up on it. And it, but it's been patched a lot now. At least um, I think it has. Yeah. Secondary. I don't know, I have two shotguns. It was like, I remember when this game first came out, shotguns were really, really good. Because the, the lock-on range is really short. So even though you have, like, assault rifles and stuff like that, um, the range is... It's really short. So I just felt that the shotgun was the best thing to use. I have, like, an AA-12 kind of laser gun. I have no idea where to go. And that's been a problem I've had with this game, is that... See, Dark Souls kind of gives you a reference on where to go. Uh, this game's a lot like really old games, like PS2 games, where it's just like... Uh, it doesn't tell you. Yeah, it's just like... Go. You know... I reload. Oh yeah. I forget how to reload. Triangle? No, it was not triangle. Or why? I forgot. These hammers let you kind of ignore shield enemies. You just go whack, whack, and like destroys their shield and their limbs and everything. How do I reload? Okay. No, that that's the bomb button. Okay, down to switch weapons. Left and right, switch that. This button? This one. Um, hmm. B. Nope, B is dodge. X. X is melee. A. Nope, not A. Left trigger. No, this turn. No. Uh, hmm. Up. Oh. oh, that's change weapons as well. Alright, game, which one is reload? I'm just wasting all my stuff trying to figure out the controls again. A. Oh, it's A while not aiming. Yeah, I forgot. This game has really weird controls. Okay, it's, yeah, not aiming, A. With aiming, A, a does nothing. This game has weird controls. And if you can't tell, this is on Unreal Engine. You could, I could immediately tell because the, because the rocks look like plastic. Or, you can't really see it here, but some of the environment, especially on this Xbox version, it looks like it's made out of fondant. I, I don't know how else to explain it. I don't, I, I don't know where to go, so. Look, as much as people hate objective markers in games, like, you know, how Elder Scrolls all has objective markers now. Uh, I kind of like that better, just because... Wandering around for hours trying to figure out where to go is uh, not always fun. Sometimes it is fun. When on a game with limited lives, like this, it, it's not very fun. 
Oh, it's not really limited lives, but you know, it's like checkpoints rather than saves. And you know, especially with the limited healing items of the Souls style games. Go, oh, special move. It's useless. I forgot. Heal. There we go. I remember there's a lot of bosses in this game that are complete uh, bullcrap. And even though you... Like, I remember I beat one by kind of glitching it out. Like, it, it was like in like a lake kind of deal. And I found you could just hide behind this one pillar and then just kind of shoot it from there if you had a long enough range gun. Hey, you see what I mean? Uh, environment looks like it's made of plastic. I mean, look at that. It looks like plastic. Plastic. Like, nah. Is this game bad? No, it's... It's decent. It's not a bad game. Is it a good game? No. It's not a good game either. It's, it's one of those, like, eh, 7 out of 10 game. It's, it's a 7 out of 10 game. And there's nothing wrong with being a 7 out of 10 game. Yeah, we... And it, like I said, it reminds me a lot... I, I don't know if I said this. It reminds me a lot of the PS2 era. Where there was a lot of games in the PS2 era. A lot of them were 7 out of 10s. Or lower. There were like a lot of 5, 6, and 7 out of 10s. There was also a lot of really good games. But there were just so many games that not all of them were going to be good. Versus, I kind of feel now in games you're either like i either hate your game or i really want to play it there's so f there's so few games now that are like eh, this is kind of good it's like a uh, like call of duty half the time in call of duty i really just don't want to play the new call of duties like modern warfare it's just like a it's annoying. Or, there's another game. There's another game that's very similar to this that came out. Uh, what was it? Uh, Rem... Rem... Rembrandt? Remnants. Remnants from the Ashes. That's one I also quit playing because I'm like, wow, this isn't... This isn't very fun. Because that one's multiplayer. This one is a single player game, like... Like, pure single player. It's not like Dark Souls where you can do co-op. This is pure single player. That goes that way too. Well, now I'm going backwards. See, that's the thing. It's like, I, you're kind of... I think you're meant to play this, like... You're not meant to stop. Like, you're, you're meant to just keep going and going because, uh... Just... It, the game doesn't tell you, so you kind of get, like, led. But I stopped for, like, a, a good long several months. I'm gonna die. I know I said this game is mainly shooting, but... Like, you're meant... Okay, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but... On the back of every enemy is a weak point. You're meant to dodge around them and shoot the back. However, with these melee weapons, if you raise your strength... <laughs> I, it, it becomes a lot easier. You can just whack the front of them and Especially if you have good melee weapons I can't go this way, can I? No, oh, this is locked. 
I need a cerulean then. Hey, checkpoint. Can I travel? Do you wish to unlock? Confirm? Oh, okay. Uh, oh, that costs a lot of. That took away all my points, stolps, whatever they are. Ever done the core? Do I have to go here? That's the thing. Like, there's multiple planets. As you can see, I still have no idea where to go. There's no quest objectives. Like, you can't open up a quest thing. It's like, oh, you know, go defeat the blah on blah. That's the thing. I also have no idea where I left off. I, I know I was on that planet, but I don't remember. I don't think there's any more bosses on there. Maybe one. Uh... I'm not gonna do a full LP of this game. No, it's. I'd have to start all over, and I don't feel like doing that. Though I could probably do a better build than just specking in the shotguns, because I think they nerf shotguns several times. If I remember going on with patch notes. Oh yeah, this is one of the first end bosses. I remember. This this guy was annoying. This boss was very annoying because you see these. It does this. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, basically, there was a boss, he had a big shield, he was very annoying because every time you stepped in one of these, if you step, it does that. Yeah, there you go, it, it traps you. Welcome to Plastic World. Yeah, beginning zone. I need a key to get in there. You know what this also reminds me of? World of Warcraft. The a lot of the Burning Legion stuff, like the Fell Citadel, like the green and black. It, it really reminds me of the Burning Crusade. This place. I get in there. No. I don't know where to go, game. I have anything that will tell me where to go? Oh, I'm camo. Okay. Um, hmm. Key items. Scare protocol. Automatic stability. I don't know what these do. Maybe there's something else on this planet. Okay. Alright. What's this way? Don't remember any of it. Oh, I've this, cause this is the first world you go on, if I remember. Oh, well here's something. Sort of. Uh, it's, it's blocked off. Oh, but there is a ladder. What am I stuck on? I am stuck on nothing. No, I'm stuck in the ground. What the? How did how did I get stuck in the ground? Okay. Now I have to die. Uh, 
Oh, this is annoying. I've never had- oh wait, I can poison myself. Maybe I can't. Got me! Come on. As you can see, still some uh, glitches in this game. It is, I think it's an indie game. I think it counts as an indie game. I don't know, it has a publisher. Hold on, I have the box. Where is it? There it is. Yes, Immortal Unchained. I believe it has two logos on it. One says Toad Man, the other says Sold Out. So I'm guessing one of those is the publisher, one of those is the developer. Anyway, they were able to afford a, the game to be published physically, so they have to have somewhat of money, because this had to be rated by the ESRB, because it has teen, and I know that cost, I think, that cost $20,000 to get your game rated by the ESRB, or... It's a lot. So, they had to have some amount of money. Oh, it's not you again. Alright. Well, I don't think I need to go there. What about a Pexion? Oh, is this the purple world? There's a purple world, and I remember it was really annoying. Oh, this game is Xbox One X enhanced. If you have an Xbox One X, I don't know how much better the graphics are, but... Yeah. Back of this is very sparse. There's a lot of empty space on the back of the, uh, the thing. The box. Whoa, who were? Well, I found out where I needed to go with these weird ladies. And so you have seen the beasts, the offspring of the one who will bring the end times. Yet, sisters, it is for us to know and the prisoner to discover. For we cannot influence your path, direction, choice. Okay. You have looked deep into the source. Paths once closed are now open. Yet, here you are. Does your path come to be by intent, or has it already been laid in darkness? Your path is gray, obscure, shrouded. You have set about a dark task, and we do wonder whether such a task would be completed if the full story were known. You may have had your shackles broken. But you are still a prisoner. The leash is yanked and now you skip, yet not eagerly. Why? What are you hiding? Something is amiss. The deviation obscures the way. Yet the end result seems to be what is called for. And therefore, fear not. All which needs to be Something is amiss. The deviation obscures the way. Yet the end result seems to be what is called for. The leash is yanked and now you skip, yet not eagerly. Why? What are you hiding? Alright, I think it's repeating dialogue. Yeah, it's repeating dialogue. Alright, uh... They didn't really tell me where to go, except that, uh, the deviation about something, uh, 
That's different. Their helmets were neat. What's this way? This the right way? I don't think so. Probably not. Yeah, these guys. It's really annoying. I remember them. They teleport around like crazy. And go blink, 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 and they blink everywhere. They have really powerful guns. Yeah, this world is very... Oh yeah, and your healing item stopped healing you all the way. I forgot. Haha, <laughs> I can walk you through the door. please. There's the thing, I don't know what's backwards or not, which is very, going to be very annoying. That way? No, oh, that is just straight down. Oh no, this is not... not the right way? Oh, hello. Oh, ah, oh, there's two. I am not good at Soulsborne-style games, especially not this one, so if you're... I hope that says something about the quality of this video. Who was that? Oh. Wow, I was late on that dodge. Back up. Aha. Oh, wait, I remember. There was a guy sitting here. And I'm out of healing items. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. Okay. This is not good. Melee is slow in this game with... yeah. Oh, well. I don't know where to go. So, I... Who? Music stop. The game crash? No. Okay. Please, I need you to tell me where to go. You have very cool helmets. And look very metal, but y you don't help me on leaving. Finding the next boss. Let's see if I remember this place. I. Yeah, you came from this way. I remember. Yeah. Yeah. This. This is where you came from, because I remember I just. You can't actually shoot the boss from up here. I tried. There used to be a boss here. All of these, like, weird techno eyes were guarded. Which means that there's stairs leading another way?
Maybe this was the right way. Ah, well. It's been 25 minutes. I think I'm gonna end it here. So, yeah, um... Probably not gonna put this game up again. I, I just didn't feel like recording Fallout 76 today. So, yeah. Um, see everybody later. Uh, it's been... Uh... Just having fun, you know, playing different games. And uh, I'm waiting for a new game to come out to put on, a cha on the channel. This is not it. This is a this is old. This is an older game. Well, not older, but it's it's old for the Xbox One. I think it came out 2018. I just never put it up on the channel. So yeah, uh, bye.